right, a little tribute to Hudson Fan 15 there. Got in a variety of packages to go over today. One was in for a couple of days, but I've been busy with the uh, custom case break and I uh, didn't get to it, so I'm going to cover that now. Update on the custom case break, by the way. All of the cards have been purchased. I'm still waiting on a couple of payments, which uh, have been. Uh, I'm sorry, I got distracted there. Payments that have been um, taken care of as far as setting up a date from trusted YouTubers, so the whole thing will be paid for. I had to front a few extra dollars of my own, and I overspent the whole thing by a hundred bucks, but um, that's my fault, and that comes out of my money. Anyways, that being said, once I get an idea of how long it's going to take to get the remainder of these cards in, uh, I'll give you guys a date. I would say right now we're shooting for two weeks from tonight. Don't quote me on it. I'll get you an update later. First package that came in, R35H93. Got a nice letter from him. What up, Mike? Hey, man. I don't know if you only saw a couple of times, but here's some cards. Hope you enjoy. Thanks, Joe. Uh, and it says on the side, I want nothing but I want nothing back. I'm trying to give back to the community. And then he writes an arrow all the way down here that says, I mean nothing! Nothing! Okay, fine! Got the message. Won't send you anything back. Inside he had a team bag here that says, Bringing back childhood memories for the win. And inside that team bag was this huge pile. We've got... Uh, a bunch of Reds, Jay Bruce, Sean Connor Conine, and old Joe Nolan. Very cool. Look at that old Eric Davis. What's up, Ken's Cards? An old Chris Sable with the sweet goggles. Remember those goggles? Solid. Valentine, an old Buddy Bell. That's cool. And this one brings back the memories. George Foster. The big Red Machine. Nice card. Jose Rio. Get a piece of history. Wilkin Castillo. There's the man, Tom Seaver. Some really nice looking red stuff here. And then some Cubs. A Larry Boa. What up, Chicago fan Jason? Doug DeCenzo. That, that goes back a little ways. There's an old Larry Boa. And my favorite, one of my favorite cards from one of my favorite sets when I was growing up. Dave Kingman, King Kong. Used to shake his ass right before the pitch would come across the plate as part of his timing mechanism or something. A little wiggle in his ass and then he'd crush a home run. It was all or nothing. Bat 220 and hit 35 home runs a la Rob Deere. Rick Sutcliffe with a little hitch in his throw. What up East Coast Chad and West Coast Chad? Edmonds, uh, an all-star Ryan Sandberg, Mark Pryor. Biggest, biggest disappointment in baseball that I can think of in a long time. Allen and Ginter, Patton, some really nice stuff there, so thanks for that. Then these uh, sent a Sean Casey game day jersey, number to 200, that's awesome. And a Derek Lee Spectrum, number to 99, very cool. And then there was something taped on the, oh, there's a Harry Douglas card taped on the back, that's for Mini Boog. Then he also sent, if that wasn't enough, a Jarius Norwood jersey. A Matt Ryan jersey. Uh, a card that was in my possession at one point, I swear to God. Uh, TJ Duckett, three color patch. Tony Gwynn, Jack of Diamonds. An old Nolan Ryan record breaker. That's really cool. A Nolan Ryan 1990 Mike Scott 300 strikeout guys. And a Nolan Ryan Tom Seaver 76 strikeout leader. Very cool. I love that. Appreciate that a lot, Joe. Thanks so much for sending that. And also, I got a little card from Cubist24. This is a little something to show my appreciation for everything you do in this community. Hope it helps your set. Let me know if you get any Houston Street cards. If anyone has any Houston Street cards, let me know or hook him up. Cubist24. And he sent me this really nice Raleigh Fingers manufactured patch, numbered to 50 for the set. No, I don't have it, so thank you very much. I appreciate that. Oh, and on the back, there's a nice YouTube auto. I've been getting a lot of those lately. Okay. And a package from our friend Cody. Oompa Deuce, Oompa 7 Deuce. I have no idea what he sent me. 
did give me a little heads up that something was on the way. Tear into this. See what it is. Oh, and it looks like it's something nasty. Now, I haven't taken the paper off yet, so I'm going to do kind of a reveal here because this looks like I see Matt Ryan on the side. Sick. It's a 2009 National Treasures Colossal Authentic Game Worn Jersey Matt Ryan with the sevens flap. Number to 50. That is awesome. A little note. Just a little something to show my appreciation for everything you do to keep this community strong. Hope you enjoy. Cody Benoit. Thank you very much, Cody. That's awesome. Right into the Matt Ryan PC. Thank you. And last but not least, I'm going to show some of the additions to my set that have come in over the past week. Numbered 1 of 95. Yeah, I know there's glare. I'll try and change this here a little bit. Mike Mucina. Numbered 14 out of 33, we've got a Joe Morgan. That's an SP. Listed as not applicable on the pricing guide. One of my favorite players of all times. Beautiful card. I love that one. Number 29 of 89 for the Red Sox. Another beautiful autograph. Wade Boggs. Love this Hall of Fame set. Great stuff. And number to 107. Keep in mind, these are very low numbers for 2001. One of my all-time favorites, the man, Mike Schmidt. Look at that beautifully centered autograph. Just perfect. Mike Schmidt. Just badass. So that's it for today. Everyone have a great weekend. But now I'll, I may be back tomorrow. If not, have a great weekend. We'll see you soon. Salute.